This has sonic blast capabilities. Oh shit. You need to breathe underwater. What the this fuck? This is like Gotham City. This Dex is laboratory. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? Coming at you again with another reaction video, and this is to Peacemaker! Season 1, Episode 1, A Whole New World. I think it's gonna pick up right where it left off in the Suicide Squad. And if you haven't seen our reactions to the Suicide Squad movie, I'll put in a link in the description. Um, basically, we all thought that Peacemaker was dead, but at the end of the credits of the Suicide Squad, we realized he wasn't. And I think Viola Davis's crew, they come together and they go to the hospital and they figure out that he went through a whole recovery and I guess they're gonna use him to help out. So this is after? Yeah. Yeah. So. Okay. It's gotta be after. I didn't know if it was a prequel, but. I would be surprised if we don't see, I don't think we're gonna see this, but I'm gonna be surprised if we don't see him with like some revenge type mentality where he's like, damn, they killed me. They tried to kill me and him try to go after them. I don't think it's gonna go that way. Oh, it's just Elba. Right. Okay, gotcha. But, uh, but I don't think it's gonna go that way, but I think realistically it should. And one thing I will say, I don't like how he did my boy Flag. Uh, I Remember uh, when they were fighting and he killed him? Who's Flag? The dude. Oh yeah, he killed Flag. Yeah. He stabbed I, him. I, one in character, the heart, in the heart. right. One yeah. character that I really did like and enjoy was him yeah. in the first one and in the the new one the sequel so i mean other than that i liked peacemaker i like john character he i think he did a great job as a peacemaker in the movie he was funny um i think he killed the role he was funny it's just kind of hard to gauge because we know what marvel's doing we know what a marvel show is we know what to expect this like is don't, this we don't, we don't know, know. What to expect. <laughs> like, right is it gonna tie into other dc characters or is this just its own thing right Maybe we'll see a cameo. Who knows? The best thing that I'm looking forward to is that it's rated R. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. I think it's a it's gonna be like a rated R fake cat from uh what was his name? The fake cat uh, from uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier. Something agent. Agent uh Black Agent? Nah. Black Agent. Because <laughs> his, his costume was black. What was it? Agents of Shield. I don't know. I don't agent know 41 yet. or something. <laughs> agent 41. <laughs> but that's kinda how I see him. Right, and without further ado, we're just gonna jump right into it. We're not gonna make this just too long. We get long interest. You guys get long interest. We're just gonna get right into it. Like this video, comment down below, and always subscribe. Previously in the Suicide Squad. Oh, what the? This is Christopher Smith. Oh, so you don't gotta watch the, the movie to know. Right. They jump right into it. Oh my. Remember that scene? That was classic. Yeah, <laughs> I love that scene. <clears throat> oh, rest in peace. Ms. Waller charged me with making sure those records don't leave this building. Peacemaker. What a joke. Right. Now, oh, boy. He had a smaller bullet. Right, mm. but his was stronger. Woo! Yeah, damn. This is your last motherfucking warning! Oh, my. She was cute too. Path is the blonde? The blonde. The blonde. <laughs> the blonde. <laughs> you know she's um, uh, James Gunn's wife. Yeah. Uh, Our girlfriend. I don't know if he's his wife. Who? The blonde. The chick. blonde. You're shot and a building falls on you and all you have to replace is a clavicle. You're the luckiest man alive. Literally right where they left off. Try to avoid lifting your right elbow above your shoulder. Sure. Oh so, shit, his arm is huge. The, the left one. With the physical therapy. Oh yeah. Oh fuck. I'm discharging you. Got Hellboy arms. <laughs> Jamil. I don't have any weed on me, man. <laughs> Truth is, I'm supposed to be in prison. For what? Superhero shit. <laughs> You're a superhero. <laughs> You're kind of bulky to be a superhero, okay, aren't you? I'm ready to go. What superhero are you? Peacemaker. <laughs> Get out of here, motherfucker! <laughs> There's no superhero called Peacemaker! Dude, I'm fucking famous! Not that famous. Aquaman, he's famous. Fuck Aquaman, <laughs> man. <laughs> Don't say that. Why say yeah, that? Yeah, don't say that. Nice chicks, good for him. He fucks dudes. Got no problem with that. What were you in prison for? Integrity. I made a vow to have peace, no matter how many people I have to kill to get it. Oh, peacemaker! Yes. You're that racist superhero. <laughs> you only kill minorities, man. <laughs> I killed a fair amount of white people too. I will trust white people less in the future and kill a higher percentage of them. Are you sad? <laughs> <laughs> On the DL, is there anybody out there looking for me? Not that I heard of, man. So, I forgot a little bit. What is his superpower? He's just really good at doing things, right? Yeah. 
Like, he's really good at killing, really good at yeah. jumping, fighting, all that kind of stuff. Because yeah. we never saw, like, no real superhuman strength. Right. That guy's a total douchebag. Oh, oh. shit. Oh. He's on the move. Literally. If you call that... <laughs> <laughs> And his costume's all bloody and shit. Why do you run like that? <laughs> the car was right there. Why do you run like that? Just the intro. I kind of like this. <laughs> That's my girl. This shit kind of fire. It is. <laughs> It's better than that musical in uh, Hawkeye? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Does this look like James Bond to you? What's wrong? Job of yours, it might be dangerous or. They got me filing papers and making reservations. It is just a paycheck. It's just for now. I gotta go. What's that mean? Hey. The dove love you, love you too. headed something. What? Oh, I think that's the girl from the the, the hospital uh, when she texted her. Yeah. I think that's what that uh, was. Okay. Here. Yeah. And this, it's uh, it's quarter mile piece money. It ain't a million bucks. What's in the bag? Now you're speaking my language. Here, you understand that? Now you're speaking my language. Well, get the hell on in. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Literally, I was <laughs> Literally, I was just about to say that. I literally was about to say that. Wait, so is Bruh. this like his hometown? This is where Eminem lived in 8 Mile. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, his right, his right arm. Yeah. That's definitely going to hinder his performance later. Think so? Yeah. He's going to be f battling some dude and... Dad? Dad. Fuck. Peacemaker, it's Vigilante. I just got the scoop on a big heroin shipment coming in tonight. Let's go down there. Who the fuck's in the shipment? Oh. Stay where you are, Smith. That's my girl. <laughs> <laughs> Why does she look like that? Your life fucking sucks, bitch. Was he in the movie? Uh, no. Mm -mm. You only served four years of your 30 year sentence. I mean, you thought we were just gonna let you go scot free? I killed Rick Flag for you people. No one ever told you to kill Flag. Wallace said do whatever I had to do to make sure those Project Starfish files didn't get out. You had no choice I could. You showed you were loyal. You're a born killer with expertise in every weapon on the humankind. And you've had experience in black ops around the globe, so I'm giving you the chance to stay out of prison and work for me. And you are? Name's Mark. Clemson and Mark? That's right. Who's that? I report directly to Amanda Waller. Okay. This is Harcourt, who you may know from Waller's team at Bell Reef. She'll be a handler in the field. You, you remember her? I remember her. <laughs> hey, dude. This is our new recruit, Leota De Bayo, which means she'll be doing most everything else. I'm really excited <laughs> to be here, and I promise you're not going to regret this domestic situation known as Project Butterfly. As I recall, you guys aren't particularly creative. Case problem. I was just about to say Project Starfish. Project Starfish was a giant walk. <laughs> <laughs> Project Butterfly. Fight the moth right now. <laughs> <laughs> we need you to do contract work. Kill people. Bad people. Whom we call butterfly. <sighs> what if I say no? Go back to jail. return to Bell Reef. What's to keep me from splitting? Still have that bomb in your head to track you. Oh shit! Fails. Damn. We'll blow you the hell up. I think they're lying. Yeah, I think so too. But how would he even get it out though? I think it probably well, expired or something. I just got swung by my dad's and get eagly. Who's eagly? It's my sidekick. Hey dad. Hey dad. <laughs> <laughs> how did you know that? Oh, oh shit. Just the guy from all the movies. What oh, movie was this oh, guy in? No. I don't get enough attention. I gotta have you chat up my fruity neighbors. Yo, talking to was me. Was he the guy from Terminator? He was. He was. was he? Yes. He was. Yeah, good catch. Somebody shot me. A building fell on me. You let somebody shoot you? Pathetic. You know, I asked you to cancel my phone service. It was still on. I've been paying for service for years because you forgot. Oh, <laughs> 
bitch. Why are you calling him now? You fucked up and went That's to prison. That's not what I'm saying. Then what are you saying? It's my service. I got no money. Jesus Christ, you're a fucking pussy. <laughs> you been taking Eagle out? Yeah. Oh my God. He's hugging him. He's hugging me. Mm. How the hugging fuck? Me. This is fucking amazing. Dad, grab my phone. I don't want to move. He's like a big ass kid. Dad? He is. We helped Task Force X during Project Starfish, and this was her way of getting back at us. Yeah, I don't think so. The new girl's an expert over here, John. Well, she's entitled to her opinion. Thank you. Her stupid fucking opinion. <laughs> oh, sweet. Guy I was working with. Bloodsport. Blood sport. Big, tough motherfucker. Mercenary. And oh, I'm yeah, he was afraid of rats. I, said, oh, I mean, like, pure terror. Screaming like a little girl. <laughs> and this other member of the team, Rat Catcher, she controls rats. <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck. I hear a joke laughing. I thought so too. This bag, it was afraid of the rats. Please, God, they say that? They said that. They said the F word. How did my fucking smirk <laughs> go into a Nancy boy like you? Look, I just came by to get Eagly and see if you had another helmet for me. Man, fuck that helmet, damn it! I mean, he's probably bulletproof. Oh, shit. What the hell? What in the Tony Stark? <laughs> damn. What the heck? Who is this guy? This is Smart House. <laughs> <laughs> this has sonic blast capabilities. Oh, shit. You need to breathe underwater. What the? This fuck? is like Gotham City. This is Dex's laboratory. <laughs> That's man dark. <laughs> I never gave you a second thought while you were in there. Fine. Just tell me when you think it's best. I hesitate giving you any helmet. You're as big a simp as you turned out to be. Damn. Well, what the fuck? If you can do some good with it, maybe take out a couple of commies, some black papers, <laughs> a cake or something. Damn, he says some poppies. <laughs> he says some blacks. I love that. I love their their relationship. It's very realistic. Oh it is. <laughs> Did this dipshit really show up in full cosplay mode? This is the guy Waller's giving us. So Waller is kind of like giving them shit because yeah, because they she, they betrayed Waller when she they hit her with the golf club. I'd be so embarrassed to sit with him. Right? <laughs> Eagly is your pet eagle. Yeah. Is your dog named Doggy? <laughs> All right. Do you have a daughter named Daughtery? <laughs> she also a guy's pet eagle much. Hey, Sweet Cheeks, can you take my order real quick? Zoodles. Good choice. Sweet Cheeks is your butt. No, it's not. It is. It's like calling somebody, I don't know, sugar tits. Technically, I think you may have sugar tits too. Let's make it that's enough. You don't have to be happy with this deal, but you still have to treat your fellow soldiers with respect. Why is that bus boy staring at you? Think that's my friend uh, Chase's younger brother. You a senator? Don't look at it here. Take our word for it. The man's a serious threat to the safety of American citizens. That's invincible. <laughs> when he was working at uh, oh, Burger shit, yeah. Burger Mart or something like that. What the hell is he doing? I just found out this girl that I'm seeing. She's pregnant, you know. We are going to have an abortion. What? Yeah, just walk away. <laughs> just walk away. He's gonna be the bad guy, I feel like. Mm. Hey, boy. Yeah. It's friendly? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hey, He's gonna bite you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, I thought you meant friendly to me. <laughs> You, I saw you pet it. Well, I don't know much shit. Don't worry about that. I've done a lot of, you know, notable things. That's super vague. Yeah, because if I told you anymore, I'd have to, you know, pew. Uh, oh, you hugged up? Married, yeah. That's cool. What do you mean when you said you heard stories about Mr. Murray? I know he's a mercenary. I know he killed a lot of people, not always for the right side. I know I don't trust his ass. Well, good night, Smith. Although I do appreciate the confidence with which you said something so wrong. Oh, that's my thing. That and having a big dick. <laughs> <laughs>
No, I'm, I'm serious. It's oh, too big, actually. Shit. Y'all love this guy. <laughs> you guys think they're going to be a thing? Her and uh, John Cena? Nah, I think they're just kind of showing this dynamic with each other. Oh, no. I, mean, about to say it, right? I was about to say. As long as it's a question about how to cure rotting fish breath, sure. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Who does that anymore? What the fuck did you say to my friend, you other fucking? What the? What the? She got some combat in her. She a widow. <laughs> she a widow. <laughs> so he told his friend that she said this to me. He hard as shit right now. I'm hard as shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he tattletailed. Yeah, why did he do that? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and his friend came over to defend him. <laughs> right to defend him. <laughs> Just because you're handsome doesn't mean you're not a piece of shit murderer. Please Damn. Handsome. Oh my God, please fuck off. I haven't been with anyone. I haven't been with any woman. For a long time. He said he's been with someone who's not a woman. <laughs> he said that? He did. <laughs> fuck yourself. Oh, oh hell nah. That's a downgrade. You might have to uh, blur this, Toby. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> so, oh, that's the nigga from Bugs Life. Okay, <laughs> I hear is not such a great guy. I don't care about the quality of the knife as long as the blade is sharp. Oh, Viola's in it. I it's knew they were related. Hardcore is oh. hard. Barbie's in That's how she got the job. Her. Shouldn't we just loop them in on the whole plan? No. You're my eyes and ears, Leota, while you're there. And the only one I trust with the big picture. Did my forger get you the diary? She a spy. This goofy shit. <laughs> this <laughs> diary. <laughs> the first chance you get somewhere, he won't find it. How's Peacemaker? Yeah, he's his own thing. Sexist. She's gonna yeah. get way too Probably emotional. Racist. Oh, you know who is her? I think oh, yeah. so too. There's something else about him that's sad. Empathy in this business, Leota, that will get you killed. Have an early morning. Night, baby girl. Night, mom. That's her oh. mom. You know, I didn't think Viola Viola Davis oh, would be so in this. Crazy. I told you they'd be related too. You think? Peacemaker feels bad for what he did to Flag. Yeah, that's why he did want to I say. I think it. so. Oh, I think this, he just thought this is my it jam. was his job to do what he was hired to do. Real man. Choir boys? She hasn't even said a word. I know. She acting a little weird. Through all the shows when they I think it's a setup. Yeah, something's weird. They're gonna fight to the song. Yep. <laughs> in his boxer. Somebody I mean, go in come. His tiny boys. Oh, not this song. <laughs> he did. He did the um. The fuse. <laughs> you gotta keep an eye on this lady, right? I was having a crazy fucked up day, but when I was in your pussy back there. <laughs> what the heck? That's a vibrator. vibrator. Oh, oh shit! What's she about to do? What the? Oh! Where'd she go? I don't know. The camera's spinning Bro, around too much. <laughs> yeah, the cameraman got slow down. <laughs> Shit, he blocked it with his fucking forearm. <gasps> she can really fight. Oh! Oh! Bro, she's fucking him up. Damn! Damn. Bro, you called it. I told you they were gonna fight to the song. Wait, what the fuck? What is she? She's like a fucking demon or something. Damn! Oh, to the table! She's a. Uh, no, she's enhanced. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you are a peacemaker. Fight her. 
Can you do the F U or the attitude right. adjustment or something? <laughs> Is kicking his ass through the wall. Damn, what did I say? But who is she? All right, what the hell? That's Mickey James. For the first <laughs> Trish Stratus. Tr <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Are you fucking serious? I'm disappointed in him. This motherfucker just flew through the window. She's better jump out too. Hell no, she landed like a cat and everything. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like some shit he just. Do you have like it too. Like a blast in the Oh, Eagly! Oh. <laughs> Is he really that hurt? Move. Oh my god. God damn, his car is fucked up too. Yo. Bruh, he just became way more interesting of a superhero. <laughs> you can do that kind of shit? That's the helmet that his dad gave him. Shit, still. I thought oh, it was, I thought it was ugly. <laughs> Thanks, Eagly. What the? F Wait, they gotta explain this. Police. Damn, this episode one. Damn, that was a good first episode. It was. Oh, wait, oh this is the end credits. I just wanna give you scabies. Give me scabies. Why do I want scabies? Challenge yourself. <laughs> Every man should have scabies once in his life. So what did we think about that first episode? I liked it. I enjoyed it. I did too. I didn't think we would get Viola Davis. And I thought it was interesting that we saw her daughter. And she's technically basically a spy. Mm -hmm. Trying to figure out. Who's not even made for it. Right. And. I wonder if she was being so weird. When we right. When she was having a conversation with John Cena. Or well, sorry, with everybody. With Peacemaker. And with everybody. Yeah. Because she was having a conversation with uh, Peacemaker um, at his car. When she was trying yeah. to. So she just kind of seemed like she was talking to him and she could tell that he was kind of innocent in his right. mindset. Mm -hmm. And then he looked like she, he could also tell that she was kind of like not an asshole or douchebag like everybody else. Right. right. So right. I'm having, a, I have a feeling them two are going to end up working together at the end. Mm -hmm. and or maybe against maybe Viola. And exactly. And what about, exactly what I was about to say. Something like that. Yeah. Uh, core score. Mm. And this this exceeded my expectations. I it thought was it was so hilarious. Good. I thought it was great. I love that type of comedy. The introduction, when they were dancing, <laughs> I didn't expect that either. I like that yeah. dark, and, unfiltered comedy. Right, and they picked off picked off right after the Suicide Squad. So the movie. So do you, off the top of you guys' head, do y'all have we ever seen a, a DC show, live action show like this? That's rated a good question. R? Not think. rated R, right? Because we so. got like the Flash, but that's not rated R. We got Titans um, was pretty like. Titan was kind of. I don't think it was rated R. It, it like, kind of felt like it. it like a TV fourteen. What was the, the Green yeah. Guy? Arrow was it Arrow. Yeah, Green Arrow. That one was rated R. Yeah. No, it wasn't. That was so a CW this like show. The first, this is like the first HBO Max exclusive DC type live action show. show. Right. Yeah, like their version of what uh, Marvel is doing with Disney Plus. Right. Let us know in the comments if there's another show that's rated R, uh, a DC show. That fits into the DC universe. Right. Because this one looks like that's what it fits into the universe. Yeah. Core score, I would got it. I got to give it a, I got to give it a solid 8.5, 8.7 range. I thought it was good. I liked it. I enjoyed it. I almost gave it a nine just because I feel like it gave us everything that we wanted. Mm -hmm. Something interesting, characters interesting, funny, some action. But I'm gonna give it an 8.9. Mm -hmm. Debatably at nine. It was pretty. It, I think it gave us everything we really needed for our first episode. Maybe. Right. I'm gonna give it a 9.4. Okay. Oh, I damn, thought Lord. it was great. Mm -hmm. Definitely. No complaints. Okay. And I think Cena is actually killing the role. Yeah. Oh yeah. In the I'm beginning, surprised. I was like, man, it's kind of hard to look at him in like 
outside of WWE. Not just that, but we've never seen him like be the main character of the yeah. acting. Yeah. So I was like, uh, he he's been in the main character a couple movies, but you're right. But it wasn't. But it wasn't like it was cheesy. Right. Uh huh. Yeah. And this is cheesy, but it's like a big role, mm -hmm. and it's also like purposeful. Um, also, I think I mean, going off this first episode, I think this has like a lot of replay value. Yeah. So, um, because like true. those 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 movies. They ain't got no replay value. Where he's like a marine or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> you know how WWE superstars they go and do a movie and it's yeah. like a they, no one a can name a John Cena movie. Either. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. This is gonna stand. Exactly. Like, exactly what I'm trying to this say. This is a legacy role for him. Right. And I think I think we're gonna end up seeing people fall in love with Eagly as this little like you know they always got these little like side yeah. characters mm -hmm. that people end up loving for movies. And the audience, they're gonna. You know love who it I want to see though is the dude who's calling him vigilante. Oh yeah, I want to see who that is. Who? The one that was calling him on the phone. He left all the voicemails. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was kind of weird with the the little invincible scene with the dude. Oh yeah, he was oh, trying yeah, to have I an abortion that. party. Yeah. Like, who the fuck is that? Like, what? They they paid they focused him too much. So he, yeah. obviously he's gonna have some importance yeah. to this show. Nothing but uh, good things to say about this episode. Thank you guys for watching our reaction to episode one. We'll see you guys for episode two. I'm a mom matching the dark. I'm a mom matching the dark. I'm a mom matching the dark. I'm a mom matching the dark.